Hey guys, um, I would just like to share with you my OPI collection. Um, I'll quickly show you the colours now and then I'll show you them up close. There you go. Um, <clears throat> just spent ages doing this, so um, I hope you all enjoy it. Um, this here is um a nail envy, but it it has a colour to it, and that is the colour there. It is um called warm blush nail envy. Um, I'll. All of these colours here, I've just done like one thick coat, apart from this one here, because um, if you've used Nail Envy before, you'll know that um, the first application you have to put two on, like two coats, and then every other application, um, every other day you put like another one on. Um, so yes, that's the warm, I'll show you quickly again, warm blush Nail Envy. And then you have this one here, which is Calling All Goddesses. And it's just like a white pearly type of colour. And it is really pretty. Like I say, um, all the other nail varnishes that they have, these are called nail lacquers. And um, that I'm going to show you now, these have all just got one Ooh, stuck to my arm. <laughs> one thick coat. Um, the next one is. Oh, sorry. This one here, which is. Let him let him eat rice cake. Again, it's just like a really pale pink color. What's that one there? And then. You've got this one here. See the all which is that one there? And that one is called Lazy Daisy Pink. I think they're really nice, they've all got like a really nice shine to them. And I really, really like them. I think they're really good quality. And then the next one is this one here. Which is a bit of a darker pink than the ones I've just showed you. And that one is called... Can you see it? Dancing in the Isles. There you go on there <clears throat> and getting darker still here's the next one and that one is called Susie sells <laughs> I knew I was going to have trouble with this, this one Susie sells sh sushi by the seashore and um, I, I don't know, I'd, I'd dare you to try and say that five times really fast. Um, but that is just that colour there. And then... <clears throat> I really, really like this colour here. It is really nice. And that one is called... Come on. Windy City Pretty. That's it there. And then the next one is this one here. And that one is called Holy Pink Pagodi. 
there's a Y underneath that S, but you can't really see it. And that does the colour there. And the next one is, I've, I've actually got two of these. And it's that colour there, and it's really, really nice. Uh, it's kind of, I think if you put two coats on, it would be like a really Barbie pink. And that one is called Passion for Fashion. Like I see, I've only put like one, <clears throat> one thick coat on all of these. And the next one is this one here, which I think is more of a Barbie pink than the other one. If you just want one coat, and that one is called All That Raspberry. And I'll, this is my favourite colour. And then the next one is this one here. Which is like a dark, like going into like a kind of dusky pink now. And that one was called Chicago Get a Manicure. Chicago Get a Manicure? I'm not sure. Probably Chicago, but I never said it wrong, but never mind. And then the next one is this one here. And it's really pretty and it's got quite a few. It's not like sparkles, it's more like shimmer. And this one is called Very Good Dancer. Dancers, I should say. And then the next one is this one here. And this is kind of like a, um, not a bronze, I'm going to pick it up properly. This one is called Marquis de Mauve. It's really pretty. And this one here, I think this one is the one that my mum wants off me, and it is that colour there. It's like a, um... Going on to like a burgundy red type of colour now, and that one is called I've Read the Script. Oops, and then the next one is this one here, which is this kind of almost like a burnt brown type of colour, and this one is called Charge It in Milan. It's really really nice as well. Um, this is probably like the reddest one that I've got. It um, obviously it's like it's not a matte, but it's not as like shimmery. It's got no shimmer in it at all. It's just basically like a red type of color, and that is called Never London Shopping. And that's the color. And then the next one is really nice. I didn't actually realise it was this nice until I've just put it on before. And this one is called Moving Out. And I think it's like a kind of like a cosmic -y purple type colour. Um, I don't know if you can see it, like all the different flecks of like different colours in there. And I think that, oh, I'll keep putting it the wrong way. I will get it right. I think that's just really, really nice. <clears throat> and then <clears throat> I've also got two of these as well. And this is called Rent. I don't know if you can see it there. Kind of looks like a galaxy, doesn't it? Like the galaxy. Well, maybe it's not, but. <laughs> And which is really faint, and I've got, like I said, I've got two of those. Oops. And then there's this one here, which is um a really really nice faint silver color. And this is called Stars in My Eyes. It's really nice. 
and then we're going on to um, a top coat, a silver sparkle top coat, and it looks like this. And you can, I'm glad that's actually picking it up properly. It's like all the different kind of colours, and this is called. Oh, did I tell you what that other one was called? Oh, did I stars in my eyes? And this one is called. It's not going to pick it up now. Paris Couture for sure glitter top coat. That's it there. Oh, sorry, my big arms in the way. <laughs> and then the next one is a gold glitter top coat. And that one is called Thrills in Beverly Hills glitter top coat. And then uh, I got this as well, and it's like it comes in this pack here, and it's really good because you can do like loads of different things with it. Um, you can obviously have it. I just I've done a few different ones. This is just um the gold by itself. And the gold is called. I get a kick out of gold. That's it there. And the red is. Oops. This one here. It. I think it actually kind of. It's coming up kind of pink, but it is red. Red. See that there looks totally in there. It's kind of coming up there. It's called Red Dazzle. And it's got like tiny bits of glit, like silver in it. I wouldn't say it's actually glitter, it's just like, I don't know, but that's it there, it's really really nice, and then obviously this is, this here is um, the gold underneath with the red on top, which um, comes up as like obviously a darker colour than that one, because of the gold being underneath. Or you could have it with the red on the bottom and the gold on the top. And then uh, there's this one here. So you can have the gold with, I know that line is totally wonky, but I've got like an airwick thing and it went psh and I got, I got a fright and I kind of jumped. So it's gone a bit ski with, but that's that there. They are the same. They are like the still these two colours here that I showed you before, and that's that one. Or you can do it the other way, and I have to do it this way because I've kind of stuck that on the upside down. And that's that one. And I think they're really pretty, and I didn't wait for that to dry properly, and it went funny, but never mind. And that is that one there. Um, I was actually gonna what what was what I was gonna do was um wait, and buy. You can get the ring the ring discs. You can get the nail discs from um eBay for three ninety nine. But what I thought, I had a really good idea anyway. Um, the other day I went to the pound land and I got um these here cotton buds and you got two packs for a pound and they've got 300 in the each and then I also got like 200 nails from um, Asda um, and some of them don't like some of them are too big for my thumb so what I did was just basically snip the cotton bud in half and then just glue it to the back of there and that's how I come up with all these Um, I hope you like my OPI collection and that's all I've got for now so thanks guys bye